G'day guys and welcome back to Aussie Gamer. Now on today's show I want to give you a quick digital TV tuner setup guide for the Xbox One. So in our last video we did an unboxing. So this is basically an extension of that video. So let's get into it. Alright, so step one is basically plug your antenna cable from your antenna into the digital TV tuner for the Xbox One and then via the USB cable straight into the back of the Xbox One and that's pretty much it in terms of hardware setup. The next step, you'll notice that right here on screen about now is the, uh, I guess the notification that says the TV tuner has been detected and would you like to set it up? Now of course we do. Now from there, here's just a couple of steps that you'll notice that you'll need to follow in order to get up and cracking. Now, we've got the antenna directly in. We don't have a cable box, so obviously we want to go with antenna. You then select your TV lineup. So this is basically your region. Now I think in the UK they had this set up via postcode. So from here, it's pretty simple. It just describes which region that I'm in in Australia. Now I'm based in Brisbane, Queensland. Um, so I'm just scrolling down here to find uh, Queensland and Brisbane. So there it is there. Click that one. And basically what it'll do then is begin scanning for channels. So here it goes. Now it does take a, a fair few minutes. I think it took about three or four minutes. So with the benefit of some editing, what I've done here is basically just fast forward that. So you can see 48 channels found. So we've got 48 free view channels here in Brisbane. And uh, from there, you just go into the next step. So these give you a couple of options. You know, do you want to pause live TV? Yes or no. So I think that's a pretty cool feature to have. So I'm going to go ahead and leave that on. Then you go on to the next feature, which is basically the ability to go and say Xbox on, which then controls your TV. So oh yeah, I think that's a really cool feature and I definitely want that on. So you get the option then to select the brand of TV you have. So I've got a Samsung and then it runs through a couple of, of tests. So it checks the ability to mute the TV. So you can see it's playing some audio and this does a, a quick check to see if the mute actual, the, to see if the mute command actually works. And it does. So, uh, so our setup is basically good to go at this point. So there's a couple of options here. Now I don't want to be, uh, to be tracked uh, in order to improve my TV viewing experience. I think I know pretty damn well what I like. So, uh, so I don't need some, uh, someone in the background monitoring my TV. So I'll just go ahead and select no on that one. Now here's an interesting one. You get the option to either go straight to TV when you turn your Xbox on or go straight to your homepage. So I like the, the homepage as it's currently set up. Look, I may change that in the future, who knows? But right now I'm happy for the Xbox to go home. And, uh, and this is a bit of an introduction to the one guide. So what I've done here is I've just, I, I guess I've edited it a little bit just to make sure you guys know exactly what's going on. But uh, from here, you just go straight into the one guide. And, uh, and this is basically what it looks like for, for Australian. So you can see uh, channel 1, ABC's there, channel 7, SBS, channel 9, channel 10, channel 11, which is basically another version of 10. We've got some awesome home shopping network channels. Uh, and a couple of bits and pieces for the kids, news, more SBS channels. And that's pretty much it in a nutshell, guys. So there you go. Anyway, if you've liked today's video, if you plan on getting a digital TV tuner for the Xbox One, go ahead and give me a big like. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. And as always, guys, get involved in the conversation via the comments section down below. All right, guys, I will see you all in the next video.